Josh Doyle, class of two. No, it's, it's just, I can't get it out. 2019, 2019. Josh Doyle, 2019, DB. Jake Perez, receiver, class 2018. Trey Mitchell, quarterback, class of 2019. Donovan West, left tackle, class of 2019. Steve McIntosh, DB, class of 2018. Eli Doyle, class of 2018, DB. that was given to me when my head coach, Coach Washington, told me to be consistent in every play and don't take any plays off because you don't know who's watching in the stands. Uh, the best sports advice I ever received was from both my parents growing up. They always told me to focus on myself and no one else and work hard and trust in God and good things will happen. The best sport advice was from my dad. He always tell me uh, never take any plays off. Start and finish the play. 110% in anything you do, no matter what it is. The best sports advice I ever got was from my dad. And it's uh, when you're off the field, you know, you can be nice and everything, but as soon as you step on the field, you got to turn into a different person. The best sports advice I've ever received in my life was just to play fast and physical. And when the game gets tough, never give in to the pain. The best sports advice I've ever received is from my coach, Coach Fred and Pop Warner, to go 100% all the time. Even if you're wrong, just go 100%. Every team memory was when we all went uh, paintballing, and it was just fun, us hanging out. We brought everybody in as a brotherhood and just we're having fun. My favorite team memory was last year against uh, Crespi. It was a rivalry game. Both teams were talking a lot of mess during the game and uh, we ended up winning by a field goal at the last second and then partying on their home field. My favorite team memory was when our team went to Navy, the Navy SEALs training camp. It was a good experience. Uh, we trained with a whole bunch of Marines and it was a great experience. It was a hard workout, but we learned how to come as a team and a bond bond with each other. My favorite team memory was uh, after lifting when we went to go grab something to eat and we really like bonded over that. My favorite team memory last year was um, going paintballing with all my teammates. You know, we had a fun time shooting at each other and it was a good team bonding experience. My favorite team memory is paintballing with the whole team last year uh, and then going out to eat with all of them. It was just super fun. The most inspirational high school player growing up was J.J. Wilson. He went to Valencia. He's now at Arizona State. Um, it's just like his passion of the game and just um, every play he went hard and he just fought for his team. High school player I liked the most growing up was probably Josh Rosen because he was very competitive, knew a lot about the game, and always stayed calm and composed no matter what. One of the most inspirational high school players I looked up to was Jack, Jack, Jack Jones from Long Beach Poly. I just used to look at the D1 bound videos of him just being aggressive and and I used to see used to just feed off of that. The most inspirational high school player was my brother and you know I just right now I'm trying to be like him, hit as hard as him and do everything he did. My most inspirational high school player probably be my brother, Danny Robinson. He played a while back at Canyon High School and he ended up winning state championship and he just taught me all my uh, assets and how to play strong and he's just a big motivation person in my life. Most inspirational high school player was probably Juju Smith at Long Beach Poly. He was just a monster in high school. My favorite class team growing up was Arizona State. 
uh, of course, because I'm keeping it right now. But I used to like them when they were younger. I like their jerseys, uh, just the way they run the defense, the coaching style, and just the environment. It's just like, it's like, it feels like I love My favorite college team growing up was uh, the Louisiana State Tigers. My grandpa's from there, and he took me down to a game when I was younger, and I kind of fell in love with the SEC environment. My favorite college team growing up was Ohio State. I always liked Ohio State because, well, plus I like Zeke Elliott because he went to Ohio State and Braxton Miller and all them. And uh, I just, and JT Barrett, I like, I just like Ohio State. My favorite college team growing up was Cal. My two favorite college teams growing up are Alabama Crimson Tide and USC because um, their teams always have good O linemen and they get drafted really high. My favorite college team growing up was Oregon because they had a fast offense and their jerseys were the best. What I did in the offseason to get better was uh, working out with uh, my Alamany team, just getting better getting better on my DB skills with coach, my coach, DB coach, Coach Lambert, and just working on my craft. What I did in the off season to get better was I worked with our, my our trainer from Proway, Dials, and uh, Coach Dials, and I did some on seven with Proway, and I just worked on my technique and just just trying to get better. This off season, I've just been in the weight room getting bigger and then doing footwork for uh, you know DB drills and all that. In the off season, I was wrestling a lot, so it helped me work with my leverage. I also went to many college camps, and then down here in the weight room, I was just been getting big. Off season, I worked on my craft with BTG and Coach Rand. This off season, I just worked out with a lot of my teammates and worked out on my own, trying to get better. And I hit the weight room, trying to get a little bigger for season, and just prepared, got in my uh, playbook, and learned the offense inside and out.